that center has the potential to be a regional center of excellence for areas of conservation and environment management. Most of the time their students are like their children to them for the time that they study here. So it's a really great community, really great family. And I feel like I could always come back here like I am now. <laughs> Before, uh, it was not easy for me to understand very well the relationship between conservation and tourism. Uh, but now I can understand very well. Just to understand that it's because of the knowledge and the skills that I acquired uh, from KCCEM. You just dig for the information and the new information you get, you use it to solve the problems for, for today and the future. So that's why we see taking our students, doubling our own efforts today and making an impact. Kitau Ecology of Conservation and uh, Environmental Management, KCCM, is uh, a public higher education institution and we are run under the Rwanda Development uh, Board. It is um, located um, in Nyamagawe district at the entrance of Nyungwe National Park. Um, it was established in 2006. By then, the Rwanda Office of Tourism and National Park uh, Board decided uh, to have a training center that would help in the capacity building of uh, its members, its staff, and also other national parks within the Albertine Rift region. There were houses before the genocide. After the genocide, they died just like anything else. They were completely, uh, it was a shamble. It, they, most of them were ro robots actually. So it was a bush grown over the destroyed houses, but they had roofs, yes. There, there were roofs, but not, it was a completely dysfunctional center. KCCM is offering different programs, including long-term programs, short-term courses, and we have also research unit. In long-term program, KCCM is offering a diploma course in wildlife management. That course is a two years course program. Uh, KCCM is offering different short courses, different on three components. Uh, a biodiversity conservation, tourism, and environmental management. Our short courses are prepared based on the client. Uh, part short courses, we have also research unity. Since 2008, we already trained around 1,000 trainees from the communities around protected areas, the professional uh, staff, and the also other different people. I've been working in National Park since 2000, and now I've gained the new skills and I improved my knowledge. So that means that uh, after these studies, I will just be professional uh, park or wildlife manager. This education have improved my skills on the job. It was actually uh, established in response to the lack of capacity in protection of the national parks in Rwanda, but also in the Albertine Rift region. KCCM is a good college where I got many skills. Because uh, before going there, I was doing a routine job. But nowadays, I have some scientific methodologies. Yeah, just now I'm uh, tracking gorillas, as you are seeing them. They have three periods of food, grass food, fruit food, and bum food, please. Avant que j'aille à Kitabi College, j'étais, donc là, je n'étais pas vraiment dans le bain. 
Oui, j'étais profond, donc je ne savais vraiment presque rien de ce qu'on peut nous. Ce que je peux dire, mammifère, c'est primate. Mais à partir de Kitabila, quand on nous a enseigné les primates, les mammifères, tout qu'on sort, comment on peut traiter un animal malade. Avant que j'y aille à Kitabi College, j'étais dans le cadre administratif. Mais après Kitabi College, directement, j'ai changé de cas, je suis entré dans le cadre technique. I have joined the course at TCCM uh, 2011 and 12. After being there, I came back on my job press. Before, I didn't have any a short course of the training about this wildlife, but for being there, it helped me on different ways, like how to conserve our nature, how these things uh, is uh, very important to our, our, our life. Denise, to her two-year education at Kitabi, she definitely got a lot of confidence, she got a lot of knowledge, um, her productivity is far better than before and her confidence is far better than before which shows very well in the tourism product. With uh, these uh, people that we sent at uh, KCCA uh, with the uh, uh, different courses they did uh, on animal behavior, uh, on uh, uh, you know, by diversity monitoring uh, research methods. Uh, when they came back, they are playing a very, you can call a supervision or support roles to trackers who are on the ground. They have come to support what we call here the ranger based monitoring. It's a system of uh, data correction on behavior, especially on gorillas, on um, uh, uh, health of gorillas, but also on different aspects of uh, 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 illegal activity. I'm a ranger in the Volcanoes National Park, in charge of uh, two groups, that means the group Hirwa, Mountain Gorilla, and the Pitonda. I was studying marine studies at the College of Conservation and Environmental Management in the Wildlife Management Department. Before I go to KCM, I was a tracker, ordinary tracker. But after the skills, I got to from KCM, practical skills and theoretical knowledge. I have changed. I have changed my mind how to love doing my work and how to do well my work. For example, in animal behavior, in gorilla data collection, and in gorilla identification. And I'm helping my, helping my colleagues to do well their jobs. We learned how to do the tourism, which doesn't disturb much biodiversity. Because we are happy because when a forest like this, when we do not have rules or uh, regulations to tourists, we can disturb much our forest. Due to the skills and the knowledge that I acquired from KCCM, I changed now the mind about the conservation, about the environmental protection. It, is, it was just like opening uh, the new window for me. We came to the, the chimpanzee and uh, we met uh, Daniel. Daniel, the guide uh, today, is very good. He knows uh, a lot of things about the forest and the, the, the chimpanzee. And uh, I think he's very calm and take care of everybody, especially of me. <laughs> he was very sleepy. Uh, so uh, he go, you know, and he goes slowly, not too fast. He respect everybody. Yes, I think it was very good. I am Ezekiel Van a former student at the same.
from uh, 2011 up to 2012. I have a diploma in uh, wildlife management. I am working in Kibia National Park as uh, a chief sector of TESA and uh, assisting the chief park warden. La formation a pu changer euh, de diverses de diverses catégories. Par exemple, euh, j'ai acquis j'ai acquis de, de, des efforts des, de, de bonnes informations de bonnes formations pour mieux gérer le parc, pour mieux gérer mieux sauvegarder les ressources naturelles. Ça c'est pour le, le bénéfice ça pour le bénéfice euh, du parc de, 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 et du pays en général. Euh, en ce qui concerne moi-même, euh, après la formation qui a duré deux ans, euh, donc euh, le, le diplôme que j'ai que j'ai euh, que j'ai acquis au niveau de l'ISSM a été tenu en considération par l'ISSM. Donc euh, j'ai vu mon salaire, euh, euh, mon salaire a été revu à, à la hausse. Euh, personnellement, beaucoup de choses ont changé parce que j'ai rentré avec beaucoup d'intelligence et beaucoup d'expérience concernant comment protéger l'environnement, comment gérer les aires protégées et comment s'y prendre au service. Notamment comment partager le service avec les amis, que ce soit pendant les patrouilles, que ce soit pendant les travaux d'accueil des touristes comme nous, nous le faisons ici et d'autres activités qui sont faits dans les aires protégées. Just the, the course learned from PCCM uh, have an, an impact. First, uh, for myself, uh, after completing my studies, I come back in Burundi uh, and I, I'm now promoted. I'm the chief of the Aquatic Protected Landscape. Uh, that promotion has an impact first on my, my family, because uh, 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 the salary uh, is improved. Uh, it has also uh, an impact of, on our service, our institution, National Conservation Institution for the Conservation of the Environment and the Nature, uh, in the world, which is my boss. Uh, in, in that way, uh, the protected area I manage will gain uh, I know how to, to manage that community around that area. I know how to manage well that uh, protected area and how the community can, uh, can live, live with uh, the protected area. Souvent, euh, dans la conservation, euh, on fait des recherches sur certaines espèces et ces gens-là savent actuellement pas mal d'espèces après avoir fait des formations au Rwanda. SCCM offers uh, internships to students, researchers uh, within the country and outside the country. Uh, our internship program uh, targets international students uh, from America and, and American continent and European, uh, the European continent, who come here to 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 study much more and experience uh, uh, nature in Rwanda and uh, the surrounding countries. We came here more for observing how KCCM does things. Um, part of what we were studying was tourism and how it's impacting development, and how conservation and tourism are sort of integrated now. Um, like for instance, the gorilla conservation project originally, a lot of Rwandans felt as if uh, gorillas were just sort of the white man's, white man's object of study and admiration. So when culture and conservation became sort of more intertwined, um, gorilla tourism started providing a lot for the nation in terms of tourism. We have uh, a library which is open for our students. We also have uh, the computer lab uh, for our students. Uh, as an advantage for our library, 
our students can access online research on environment. We have accommodations. We have rooms for rent, and they do have our, 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 our restaurant. We have more casual workers, apart from the other departments, so we have different staff. We have casual workers who are helping us in our accommodation. Chitabi College uh, uh, wants to live uh, together happily with the surrounding communities. And that's why we feel they should be part and parcel of the college activities. And um, in our daily programs, we involve communities and reach out to them with different uh, programs meant for them. Hari <laughs> Nari mfiti nzimu, hali kubungu huu maze kujiri nze shatu. Uh, nyuma, ndete hali mosimu, mwere mure shatu zose zili mosimu. Haba anagosi wali mishuri, hauguru mwambari, hauguru mitiwe. Nari mfiti stungo, jitu kwenye. Chujiri njia wanayo nari mfiti. Aho nari mfiti, sambo ya nje, nojie 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 hauto ndi turimu. Conservation and environmental management are fundamental to creating a green economy. And that's something you hear a lot about within this region, is how do we have economic growth based on sustainability principles. So KCCM, by training people on these basic skills, we can ensure that as green economies are starting to develop, that they're grounded in, in conservation and environmental management so that the benefits um, can be sustained over the long term and that this region can continue to be looked at and known for its conservation ethics. Tourism industry, as you know, is uh, now the, the largest foreign exchange earner for Rwanda for the last five years. So, you, uh, first of all, that's, that's a big... And also on the job market, tourism is uh, really employing so many people. Tourism uh, at a global level, you can see uh, tourists' numbers growing, the industry growing. The, the investments that are coming in. Look at Nyungwe. Uh, I would say in two, 2005 when it became a national park, government wanted to first of all protect the national park but also develop tourism industry. And you can see how uh, investors are coming in. The, the, the hotel industry is growing. Uh, the community tourism growing around Nyungwe. All those, uh, even uh, uh, the funders coming in, the, all those are things that are attracting uh, investors into uh, investing in tourism industries. We expect to have uh, one complex which will have uh, the classrooms and the academic offices, which is good also for KCCM. I thank too much the RDB and MacArthur Foundation and other donors of our partners of KCM who gave us opportunity to come and 
who offer the funds help us to study here. We are very grateful for the government of Rwanda. We're very grateful to our dear president, His Excellency Paul Kagame, and uh, all uh, his government. We want to thank RDB Rwanda Development Board, uh, especially the Tourism and Conservation Department. I want to thank uh, the generalist from MacArthur Foundation. Since 2006, they have been supporting the college in different uh, activities. Uh, th through their 1 million uh, 200,000 uh, USD dollars, uh, we have been able to organize the college and develop a couple of uh, authorities uh, we have at the college. Uh, we are very grateful that uh, the grant has provided scholarships to the students in the region. They, through the grants, we have acquired uh, some uh, facilities uh, like buildings, field equipment, equipments, uh, field vehicles for our students to go and acquire hands-on skills in different areas at the field. We are grateful to the government uh, of Netherlands uh, for capacity building support. We are grateful for uh, Wildlife Conservation Society. We're grateful for International Gorilla Conservation Program. We are grateful to our regional networks that we, for which we are members. Um, uh, RIFIAC, uh, which is a regional network for conservation and environmental management uh, colleges in Central Africa. Um, we are grateful for International Green Foundation. Uh, Dr. Jethro Dang. Wherever you are, uh, we want to thank you. Uh, Dr. Paul Scott, wherever you are, we want to say a big thank you for having set the scene for KCCM to be what it is today. I want to thank also the Kitabi College uh, board members who on each day uh, provide advisory services uh, to the college and, and they give us a sense of direction and we are very grateful for, for that. My staff, our former students, all our current students and all our well-wishers, we want to say thank you very much. May God bless you.